Hey everyone, this is Just a Tech and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I will talk about the latest iOS 16.3 bypass. If you remember last time on my channel, I have uploaded a video on the bypass trick that will help you to bypass without serial change, without DCSD cable and without purple mode. That tool got the new update. Now the tool is supported on the latest iOS 16.3 so now you can use it on your iPhones and iPad and easily do the bypass without serial change in a single click. So we will see the practical process on the tool. First you need to download the latest 1.3.2 version. You will get the links from the description or go to my blog. You will get the direct links there. The latest version at the time of making this video is 1.3.2. But in future, if the new version come, use the latest one that will upload with the same mega link. So first you need to download it and after that simply install it on your system. You can also run on the Hackintosh as well. So if you are a Windows user, install the Hackintosh and after that you can run or if you have a Mac, that will be great. Now after that, simply launch the tool. Alright, now once you open the tool, your device need to be connected in the normal mode. After that tool will detect the device and it will show the ECID. First you need to copy that ECID in order to use the tool. You need to register the ECID in the server. For registration that's very simple. Copy the ECID. After that note it somewhere and send me that with the model number. After that I will register the ECID. You can contact me on my any social media handle. You will get all my official social media handle from the description link. Better you can contact me on telegram for the direct registration or go to my blog you will get all the links there. For the prices, I will show it on the screen for the iPhones and the cellular iPad. If you have a Wi-Fi model iPad, currently that is not supported at the moment, but in future maybe it will support. So I will show the complete list on the screen so you can pause the video and read it out. Now once you have registered the ECID, you are ready to use the tool. Connect in the normal mode and click on the recovery button on the tool. After that, your device will go into the recovery mode directly from the tool. Now once you see the recovery screen, next you need to put your device into the DFU mode. So click on the begin button on the tool. After that you will see the DFU instruction. Follow that on your device and then continue further. Now once the device is in the DFU mode, you will see the activate button on the tool and you will see the user lane exploit. After that click on that and wait for your device to load the custom RAM disk or you can say the custom checkmate jailbreak for the device and after that we can proceed for the bypass. Now the booting step is complete, after that your device will on, but this is the half step. Now you need to stay on this screen and wait for the tool to detect again and after that we can complete the bypass process. It will take around 1 minute to detect the tool connection, so just wait for it to get complete and after that you can fully activate the device and as you can see that it start detecting the device. Now you can see the device is activated and you will see the same on the tool and after that your device will take a quick reboot. Now once you see that it will done. Now wait your device to complete on. Now it's here. After that select the language, connect with the Wi-Fi and set up the device and this time you will see the date and privacy page and you can see that we have successfully bypassed the latest iOS 16.3.
Alright, welcome to the iPhone and we are here on the home screen on the latest iOS 16.3 with this new HFZ activator. You can follow the same process for iPhone 6s to iPhone X and other iPad models that are supported with the tool and this is the one click untethered bypass so if you reboot the device it will not affect the bypass it will on again normally. And this bypass is also support the OTA update so you can update your device directly from your settings without lock again and if in case if you accidentally locked it again after the flash or reset just reuse the tool again and it will work. Re bypass is free after the register ACID so you can reuse the tool anytime you want. So now you can see that the device is working again. And also with the bypass, the eye services is also working like iCloud login, FaceTime, Siri, App Store, as it said without serial change bypass. So the device is fully activated. So you can use all other eye services, but the cellular or SIM network will not work. So for the SIM bypass, you can check out my other videos like Checkmate, Eye Removal Tool, and the SMD activator. That will work for you with the network also. So let's see one by one all the eye services. So now you can see that the eye login is working. And you can see on the screen the FaceTime is also working. Let's try out Siri. Hey Siri, open the camera. So now you can see that I have tested everything so let's reboot the device again and see after the reboot all this will be persistent or not. So after the reboot also everything looks good and normal. So this is how you can use the latest HFZ activator and easily do the bypass in a single click without serial change, without purple mode or without DCSD cable. You can follow the same process on the supported devices. Register your ECID and use it now. So that is all for this video. If you have any questions or doubt, just ask it in the comments. I will see you in the next video. So till then, goodbye, take care and peace out.